Her name is Amanda by John Renault. Long, beautiful layers. Her color is really outstanding and I want to explain it to you. Amanda's color here is 26 RH14. Now when you see the RH like that instead of R in a number which means rooted, when you see RH it means that John Renault has highlighted this with R, only Renault, 33% of the lighter color. And that's uh, usually they're about 25, but John Renault, and I'm pretty sure, I'm not going to bet my grandkid on it, but I'm pretty sure that he's the only one in the industry that does this special RH highlighting, which is 33%. She's layered, as I said. She's a whopping 16 and a half at the nape. Now, the Ariana that we just showed you a few minutes ago, that was 20 inches. So this is a little bit shorter, but not by much. But here's where you get the glorious movement in the Amanda. And that's because her bangs are nine plus a little, maybe a fourth or so. Then her crown is a whopping 18 inches. But then you go to the sides, right here by the ear tabs, and they're like 10 and 3 fourths, almost 11. So you have 9 and a fourth, 10 and 3 fourths, and then 18 up here, and then in the back, from your occipital bone, is 16 and a half. So you get lovely movements in this. I'm gonna try it on for you because it's got um, a mono top double crown. It does not have the smart lace. On this one, you don't really need it. It's got the open cap so that it's very comfortable. Now, let's try it on, guys. I just took this out of the box. So I want to see what it's going to look like on us. Here we go. All right, let's find our temple tabs because we're going to put it on like this. Then we're going to reach around, go down to the really bottom of your forehead, or the beginning of your forehead, whichever, and then you're pulling it down to the occipital bone in the back. Walk around, find those temple tabs, get them even, just like an arrow going right through your head. Then, oh, I can feel the shorter bang on this. Then you go up. I have mine about four fingers for my brow bone. Usually it's four, about five. And the way you can tell that, if you go here and here and here, your face is divided up into two thirds. Here from the brow bone up, here from like the top of your lip up, and then here from your chin to the tip of your nose. Just a little lip tip from your Uncle Lair. <laughs> okay, guys, here we are. Just took it out of the box. I don't know where. I think that one might go there, but maybe I'll go there. It's a full mono top. What does that mean instead of a mono part? Well, it means that you can really part this any way you want. Where's my cap? And then you can set it that way. So say you want to put, let's go like this, and you want to start it like that. Maybe all the way through. Get a nice, a nice little part. Now, when you have a monotop, and it's a full monotop, and you want to change it to maybe a center part, okay? Here's how you do it. You can part it like this and it will look okay. But to set it and really get it good, I want you to rub your hands. Get some friction, get some heat going, heat going, heat going. Then, I want you to lean back. I want you to find that part. I want you to press it. One, two, three, four. I usually count to 40 or 30. Press it, press it, press it. I'm putting my whole hand on it. If you, if you still want it poofy or what, you just lift your fingers like that. But I want mine to get real flat, and so we can see the length and how gorgeous it really is. 
It works best if you count to about 30. Then I want you to press and print. And what have you done? <laughs> You've printed you a new part. That's what's great about a full monotop. Okay, let's take a little brush pick and let's see what we've got here. Remember this color, 26 RH 14. 26, 30%, 33% highlighted. Highlighted 14 is the warm brown, ashy brown color. The lighter color is 26, your bright gold. Have a great day. Try these long wigs. You know, you can always return it if it doesn't work. But geez, aren't they beautiful? Have a great day, guys. Bye.